All right, YouTube people. I have a 2005 Legacy GT Subaru, and I had kids that spilt some milk, and it was draining down my plug, down where the seat belt goes, and get in my car and I was like what the heck is that smell so I am gonna show you guys how to take out a seat for a 2005 Subaru Legacy so if you come down here and you look you see these little clips all you gotta do is just pull up so pull your seat up and then it releases the clip it just sits in there and then go around, do it on the other side. Oops, let me get over here a little bit better. Just pull it up. It's pretty forgiving, so don't think that you're going to break it. And now your seat is removed. Your rear seat. And you just pick it up and pull it out. Then you have this little hook right here that attaches in here. Then you pull it out and there you go. Then if you also fold this up, you most likely have your uh, fuel, fuel pump and all this stuff right here. But anyways, that's how you get your seat out to clean your kids' milk that is spilt. And it just goes on the same way. You just move your seat belts out of the way. As you could tell I've cut out areas where the milk actually still was there. So then you just put the seat back down. It would be easier if I had someone else helping me film this as I did it. Sorry for the filming. This is my first YouTube video but I googled it and YouTubed and could not find anyone that did it for a 2005 just a 2011 so I wanted to have one out there so people won't be frustrated like I am I was so as you can tell you can see the there's the little hook down there then you hook it in make sure it's in and you just push it down same same on the other side Push it down. There you go. Your seat's back in. Well, hope this helped you. And hope you guys don't have the same problem I did. Thanks. Bye.